Scout Dad here. Um, <clears throat> what I got going on here is I'm getting uh, one of my gardens ready for this spring, or yeah, for spring, uh, since it's right around the corner. Um, I'm pretty much showing you what I've done so far. I've only done a little bit over half of it, okay? Been about 10 minutes, not long at all. When I first started that, it looked like this, okay? Now, there to there. This was the beginning. Um, I left the leaves in there because the leaves make really good compost. Uh, I had Nandinas growing in there, as you can see over here. But my son decided to clear those out for me. And what I did, I'm out of breath as you can tell. I, I used a hand tiller. I did not use a gas tiller. Uh, let me show you what a hand tiller looks like for those of you that don't know. This, oh, it's got some trash on the phone. I was using it there. This is a hand tiller. Um, you can see right here, it's where you put your foot to push down on it. It's got the spikes going to the ground. Once you get them in there, say it here. You put it in there, put your foot in the hole, push it down. Now, all the way down to where your feet's on the ground. Now, of course, I'm only going to do this with one hand, so uh, I'm going to try to hold the phone with my chin. Uh, but what you do is, I guess it's kind of working. Oh, sorry. I'll do it one hand, I guess. You grab it with two hands, one here, one here. But what you want to do is you want to twist it. And as you twist, it's going to pull up. See? And there you go. You got tilled ground. Alright. Now what I did is I took this trash can here and I've been keeping my remember me telling you it's garden gold. Yeah. The chicken poop. Rabbit poop. Garden gold. When I clean out and muck out the cages this is what I put it in. Old trash cans that people throw away. Um, this is one trash can full that I have pretty much tilled with this hand tiller into the dirt. As you can see, the straw is still there and stuff like that. But straw is good. It keeps your dirt loose. Okay? Now, I know that from my previous attempts at a garden, you're going to say, I ain't listening to him. Well, let me tell you, I spent all winter researching gardens how to do a garden if this fails I guess we'll just go hungry and die if shit ever hits the fan anyway I got my my shovel here I got my hoe this one not the one in the house I, she'll get mad if you and she knows I called her a hoe but I use that to spread out my chicken poop my garden gold um, and I just mix the dirt with the using that tiller right there. Oh, I also spread it out with my pitchfork. Brand new, finally got to use it. Spread it around, and then I tilled it in with the tiller, the hand tiller. Why a hand tiller instead of a gas tiller? One, have you priced gas tillers? Huh? Uh, uh I ain't doing that. Two, what happens if shit does hit the fan? And it stays hit the fan, and as uh, Jay Noel and a few others have started calling it, and I kind of like myself, and own our own situation, and we can't get gas to run the tiller, you're going to be reduced to something like this, and that, and that. No gas means no tiller, so you might as well do it by hand. Anyhow, this is where I'm going to plant my tomatoes. Uh cantaloupes and stuff like that's going to be in this little garden here um, I'm probably going to put my potatoes I got my tires and my dirt I'm probably going to put those right over there in that corner behind the pitchfork handle I'll start those right there um, but I'll start those probably in a week or two I don't want to get those in the ground yet it's still a little chilly at night dropping down into the low 30s but um, yeah, I just wanted to share with you what I'm getting, what I'm doing with my gardening. 
And this is stage one. I'm getting the dirt ready. I got to go fill this back up with some more chicken poop, rabbit poop. And then I'll be back over here with doing the other half of it. And that little corner there that I missed. Well, uh, I hope you've enjoyed this five minutes of phase one of the Lanford Homestead Gardening. <laughs> uh, as always, guys, please be prepared, be ready, stand tall, stand fast. Love you. Mean it.